Dakota Harris was murdered while walking near the intersection of Asbury and Glenfield on November the 19th, 2020, at approximately 12.26 p.m. A vehicle pulled up and fired shots at him. Dakota was only 24 years old. Today, his mother is here, supported by the Detroit Police Department, um, here to tell his story and to let the murderer know who it is that they took away from them, her. Sorry, go ahead. Uh, whoever did this to my son, I, 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 my only concern is I just want to know why, you know, I don't wish no ill on you, um, I, I, and, and, and I want you to have a conscience about what you did, and, and find it in your heart to, to talk to God and get some direction from Him on where you go from here now with your life. You know, because you have to be accountable for what you did to such a beautiful soul. He was an artist. He loved his family. He was a great friend. You just, if, if, if you just came into his presence, he was a needed confidant. If you needed him as a young black man of the community. He was the type of person that he would cut your grass, you know, he would shovel your snow if he was in your presence or just knew that you needed help. Um, I just want to say to this, he, he, he was born as a child of God. He was very educated. He was looking forward to becoming a artist. And you all just do not know what you all took away, not only in this world, but in this community. Like I said, you see something, you say something, you know something, send a message in a bottle, write it in the sky. <laughs> you know what I mean? But get that message out to the needed, to the needed agencies and people that needs to know how to solve all of these unsolved crimes. And with that, I bid you all my love. Awesome.